look at you here and oh are the viral gochujang caramel cookies any good that is the question we will be answering today okay the recipe we will be testing is by eric kim of the new york times oh you know that popular newspaper yes we don't read it anymore but the recipes fire or we shall see we need one tip oh you see how soft this is almost as soft as your skin oh you're looking good i see the acne's clearing up oh one tablespoon of unsalted butter we need two tablespoons of dark brown sugar as well as what is this gochujang yes korean fermented chili chili paste this is mild. Let's give it a little taste tester room, me and you. Oh, cowabunga! Spicy, salty, a little sweet, just like you. We need one heaping tablespoon, as per Eric Kim's suggestion. So, like so. One heap. Then we're gonna do a little mixy mix. We're gonna do a little mixy mix. Oh! Until the gochujang, the butter, and the brown sugar get nice and incorporated. Master Chef Miku, how's it looking? Do a little sniffy. Let's get this video to 200 likes. Spicy, huh? So you can give Miku a juicy cherry at the end of next video. <gasps> okay, what do we have here? We have a bowl haircut and... Oh, we're, we're living fancy today. Look at you. What is this? What is this? Astronomy? No. UFO? No. It is a kitchen scale, okay? So, to the bowl, we're going to add the remaining seven tablespoons of unsalted softened butter. Oh, look at this. Should I lick it? One cup, 200 grams of white granulated sugar. We also need one oof, okay? Room temp, large. Oh, it just broke the yolk. The yolk just broke. We need Half a teaspoon of coarse kosher salt. Yes, very specific, I know. Oh, look how coarse it is. Of course it's coarse, golf course. By the way, I've been golfing lately. Oh, that sounds so bougie. No, honey, I go to the golfing range and I'm like this. Tiger Woods, boom! And I hit home run. That's baseball. Anyways, a quarter teaspoon of ground cinnamon. If you know me, I love, I'm a cinnamon girl. I'm a cinnamon girl. And finally, yes, finally we have some pure vanilla extract. All right, I got this at Costco. That's why it looks like a Coke bottle, okay? One teaspoon of vanilla extract. And we're just gonna incorporate the butter the egg all those seasonings is sugar cinnamon and everything else a seasoning or is that only for savory foods it looks weird it looks weird do you see this do you see how weird this looks it looks like cottage cheese hmm this does not look appetizing can this be fixed, guys? Uh, I think we should restart. So, BRB! <laughs> okay, this, this cookie recipe is already stressing me out. So, I will have a, a break. Hold on. This is salt and vinegar pistachios. I need energy. Mm. Let's crack a cold one. 
Diet Grapefruit Soda. This time, we're gonna do fast forward and I'm gonna turn on AC as I redo. Done! This is much better. We need some baking soda, not baking powder. The soda. Like this. We need half a teaspoon of baking soda. And we're gonna use the spatula and fold it in. Finally, don't be afraid of gluten. This is my all-purpose baby flour. Not baby flour. My all-purpose baby, which is flour. All right, we need one and a half cups of AP flour. Mix the beautiful butter and the flour together until a nice dough forms. Oh, what is this? Butter, all right. Now on the New York Times article, Eric Kim said, mixing this dough by hand is highly recommended for the most defined crinkles, like my wrinkles, and the chewiest texture. Oh, thank you, Eric Kim, for making everything so accessible. Okay, not everyone has that KitchenAid stand mixer, that baby blue one. I see you have that behind you. Can I have it? Gift it. Thank you. All right, oh, look at this. Nice and incorporated. All right, all we gotta do now is... My, my finger's clean, don't worry. Okay, just remove any excess dough at the spatula, spatula, Silicon Valley. All right, we just gotta chill it. Just like you, you're so chill. For 15 minutes or so in the fridge. BRB. And we need a baking tray. We will put some parchment paper. Why is it called parchment paper? That's the most oddest name ever. If your name is parchment paper, I apologize. I was not trying to offend you. Yes, here comes the part. I'm dreading, okay? And I'm not being sarcastic. This part looks hard. We have to swirl the gochujang into the dough without making it orange, as in without fully emulsifying everything, okay? There should still be nice streaks, like a nice pralines and cream ice cream from Baskin Robbins. So we're gonna just dollop three dollops okay that is what eric says he uses a metal spoon so we shall too and we need to make full circular strokes and don't over mix it so okay i'm scared okay oh the dough is quite tough but we're just going for it. That's why we have a metal spoon. Okay, done. How long did that take? Now, look at you went a little bit crazy, a little bit wild last night. And she bought, oh, what is this? A tissue paper? No, we didn't buy tissue paper. We bought a cookie scoop. Yes. Is this how you use it? You like press it against the wall. We're gonna do like here. Right here. Come on, cookie. Oh, look at that. Looks like Mars. There's a lot left over. We can cook another batch. All we gotta do now is place it into our 350 Fahrenheit, 175 Celsius degree oven and bake for 10 to 13 minutes. After around 11 minutes, our cookies are freshly baked and oh, look at that, nice and golden brown. And let's dig in. All right, so this is the finished product. 
and I'm super excited. Oh, as you can tell, I baked more cookies, so it looks more plentiful, abundant. Okay, pick one, pick one. Tell me when to stop. Stop. Oh, you can see a lovely gochicha crust on the right. Oh, let's look at the bottom. Oh, nice and golden. All right, cheers. First bites for you. Mm. Nom, nom, nom. When you first take a bite, you get hit with that punch in the face of crisp. But there is a chew, a slight chew, all right? The middle is more chewy. Then you chew a little and you get that spice. That edge tastes like gochujang, quite salty actually. So, of course we need some milk. <sighs> yes, that helps balance it out. It tastes like cinnamon. You know what it tastes like? It tastes like those, I forgot the name. You know what I'm talking about. It's mostly in America. When I went to the US, they have them. It's in like hot tamale, hot tamale. You know the jelly bean looking things? Cinnamon flavored, spicy, chewy. Tastes like that in a cookie. And of course, oh, look at that. Of course we have to dip it. It depends on the cookie, but some parts are sweeter, some parts are saltier, just like me. Are these cookies worth making? That's the real question. Mm. Yes. Okay, I would never think to put kochucha in a cookie, but it works, and it's beautiful. Okay, this is probably the prettiest cookie besides you that I've seen, okay? Do you just see this? This is Mars, okay? And we all wanna travel to Mars. A big thank you to Seymour Plant, XX Tarn Production, and Mike Green Tea for your Super Thanks donation last video. I was able to purchase the cookie scoop as well as the kochichang and all the other ingredients to make these beautiful batches of cookies for everyone. And, ow. I'll see you guys next time. Make who gets juicy steak. Eat. Yummy, right? And if you're still here, comment, I'm strong like gochujang. To confuse everyone.